we're going to use a program called Autocrat to mail merge data from a spreadsheet onto a document and then produce uh, the PDF documents or Google documents from that. And so what you do is you create your document in Google Docs and then you put in the merge fields with a double less than and a double greater than at the end of it. And you can see here we're doing the address, we're doing the name, the course, the date. You can do any fields that you wish. So we'll go to the spreadsheet. You can see here that the merge fields I've set up across the top and I've put some data in there. To add on Autocrat, go to the add-ons at the top, click get add-ons, type in Autocrat, press it, and press the install button and continue. And you'll get some security warnings, just continue through all of those. Once Autocrat's been installed, click on get add-ons, go to Autocrat and then press open. Okay, we're going to create a new job by pressing on this button and then we'll give it a name and press next and then we're going to choose our template document this is the certificate document that we just made so I'm going to click from drive and then we'll just search for that we'll click the certificate document press select after a few seconds it'll come up and, and put it there and then we press next and it's got our merge fields. So we're going to select the merge tab, which is our sheet one. And it's going to connect our merge fields together. If it's not connected the right merge field together, that's the one that's in the document. This is the one, the column that's on the spreadsheet. You can just click and change it. So here it's done them perfectly because the names are aligned. We're going to press next. And then we're going to give it a file name for what we want each file to be called. So I'm going to put in name and then we'll call it certificate. Okay. So that's a mail merge field of the name that's in the, the column. And then we're going to put certificate at the end. Now we can generate two types of things, Google Docs or PDF. So I will do the Google Docs. We can do it as a single output mode, which is one page after another, if you're going to print them, or I want a separate file for each person, so we're going to do classic mode. I press next again. Where do I want these files to go? Well, I'm going to uh, choose a folder, and then I'm going to press them on my other. You can choose any folder you like. We'll then press on next, and next again, we don't need any dynamic folder references. Merge conditions. We don't need any for this particular case, but if you want to do exclusions and things, you can use this tool. So I'll press on next again. Do we want to share the docs and send emails? Well, we could, if we had an email address, we could say yes, and you could put the email address in here, and it will then share the documents. We don't have an email address on this, so I'm just going to press next again. If you run this with Google Forms, you can get it to automatically run, and that's what these are for. But in our case, we don't need any of that. So I'm just going to press save because we're at the end of the process. Once that's done, press the play button and your job will run. Once the job's finished, just close it down. And you'll see that on the spreadsheet, it gives you the link to the document that's created, tells you the ID of the document and if it was successful or not. So to open up the certificate, you just press it and it'll take you there. And you can see that all the address and all the details are in there. To find all the certificates, just go to the Google folder that you told it to create them into.